is the day I beat Security Breach Ruin, I think. And, uh, let's just hope this is probably the last time that I touch this game unless they make a Security Breach remake. Okay, so the footage got corrupted last video, but now we are here. Basically, we went through a vortex, and now we're at this vent place. Now, this is the Princess Quest arcade machine with a sword stabbed through it. And you look at it through the mask, and yeah. So I'm guessing. Bet those security nodes are all the way down there. Hey, we're at back at Bazaar Blast. Bad bear. Or I don't know what that said. This is like where Vanier's room was. What the hell are you doing standing there? Okay. Okay. Okay, what the fuck? I was just about to finish it too. Fucking stupid. That was cheap. That was cheap. Fucking shit. 
Okay, so let me guess. Let me guess. I have to do another one of these shitty puzzles. Okay. Next for that game, Seal should collaborate with another studio because, like, them just working on the games is terrible. I will admit it's quite much more functional than the last game, but, you know, I'm not gonna. Okay, fucking dumb fuck. There's a reason why this game isn't scary. Okay, what? What in God's name am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to fucking track down this fucking red wire? Okay. Okay. How the fuck am I supposed to get in there? I guess we know what ending's canon now! Fuck! Oh, uh, Fucking Steel Wool Studios, everybody. Steel Wool Studios. Look, look. <laughs> like, what the fuck? What? Okay. You just disap- Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Please. Oh my god. <gasps> Freddy Fazbear, everybody. Freddy Fazbear. I'm not even scared of this game anymore. I was scared during the last section, but like, 
The fucking the mini shit was like the scariest, but like now it's just now it just feels like security breach. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Oh. Okay. Do I go through those doors? Like. Cassie, can you hear me? I finally have a clear signal. Gregory, I shut down all the security nodes. I'm in the Roxy party garage. Am I close? Almost. There's still one node left that's keeping the underground sealed. Where? Roxy's the final node. You need to deactivate her. But. Deactivate her. Why the? Save me, Cassie. Why the fuck does she? It's so dark down Why the here. fuck does she sound like she's AI generated? Deactivate Roxy. But I kind of don't want to. Like. So Roxy is the final node. Give me back my eyes! Oh shit! You remember me? Your special day. I remember. Your special day. Do you still like carrot cake? I love carrot cake! It has been some time since I saw you last. If I remember correctly, it is on the 11th. No it's not! I remember because you are number one. Twice. Have you booked your party? I'm sure your friends will show up this time. Don't talk about my friends like that! Cassie? What are you doing? Oh shit. No, I'm not doing this. There has to be another way to circumvent this. Come on. Oh shit. So sorry. I love Harry. Happy birthday, Cassie. Fox. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Rocks use the final note. So where do I go? Oh shit. The burn trap room. Where it's busted wide open. Okay. Why is it sealed off though? By the network coverage. Okay. Well, I guess Gregory's down here because he got... I don't know. Wait, when he said he was taken at the beginning of the game, could he have been taken by the blob? Oh shit, that... <laughs> Stop crying, bitch! I need to focus on the game. Isn't there like an elevator I'm supposed to go down? Okay. 
I don't know how it's back at the top, though, because it's supposedly never supposed to go back up. here again. What the shit? We can't use the mask here. So this is all sealed off. Now, we're supposed to go through the Freddy heck? Okay. Why did... Why does this not even feel like Five Nights at Freddy's anymore? I'm going through a fucking cave. This feels like fucking, uh, Unreal Engine assets, bro. I swear they use assets like this. Okay, uh... Let me through, please. Thank you. What the fuck? What the hell is this supposed to be? No! No, 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 no. Come on! Stupid flashlight! Hey, do I go over the water? Okay. Um... Don't have the flashlight anymore. What is this place even supposed to be? Faz token. What is that, like the FNAF world token? The pizza... Candy Cadet! The fuck are you doing down in this fuck? Candy Cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy, candy all day. day. Every day. Candy. 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 Okay. Now I will tell you a story about a mother and a little boy who lived alone in a cabin in the dark woods. There was a monster in the woods, but the mother caught it and kept it locked in the basement. Okay, I think that's enough information for me not to go downstairs. So, Gregory. Not really Gregory, huh? Is there a way I can say into the walkie-talkie that I'm not falling through your trap? Or, like, whatever. So, if there's prize boxes around, there has to be more, right? So, like, okay, yeah. Okay, so this is where we came through. I actually want to get a good look at this area. So the water is red for some reason. Red color. Bathe me. Bathe me in water. Okay, so... I don't know how they're keeping this shit underground. It's just like some sort of magic cave. Magic, the wizard, some wizard FNAF guy. I'm gonna turn the brightness down for this. I have it set up by like 10. Let's see how, oh, that makes it much more atmospheric, okay. Yeah. The monster always made scary noises at night, but the mother would tell the boy not to worry because it could never get out. Then she would sing the boy a lullaby to sleep. One day, the monster stopped growling and instead 
Wait, I heard this from the books. Is this the mimic? Oh shit, are they actually making the books canon? The mimic? Oh no. There's gotta be another present. It mimics the lullaby. Present. Holy shit. Why are there a... burners everywhere? It's like the inside of an oven. This is probably where Burn Trap was set on fire. Those. This door. Oh, holy shit. What's in here? There's nothing. Okay. So Burn Trap isn't in the recharge station. So. The Burn Trap ending isn't canon, which I thought it would be. It should be, because it seems like the only canon ending, but like, I guess that Gregory drew the comics, but that doesn't make any sense either, because the next day when my mother went out on fine food, the monster sang the lullaby from the basement. The little boy heard the lullaby and opened the door. <laughs> Candy? Candy Cadet? I did collect another Faz token at the beginning of the game. So I'm just wondering if that's an Easter egg probably that somebody found. Let's see. Is there like one more present in this room? Oh yeah, there is. Let's see. Can I grab it? Comic paint. Okay, so I guess Gregory is a fanfic artist. He was writing fanfiction the entire time. So I guess freeing Vanessa ending is canon. Because he was in Vanessa and Freddy Head's care. And then uh, he decided to uh, write fan creepy fanfiction. Because if the games are real in the lore, that means that Gregory is likely a FNAF fan. Does Gregory like FNAF? What the fuck? I already did this. So we're going back, we're going downstairs, like, to the basement, and then there's going to be creepy monster thing. Gregory ba Backpack, so he was down here. M X E S. Okay. Hello, bunny man. What do you do? Oh, okay. Guess he's dead now. 
stupid door won't open. Well, it looks like someone poured concrete over the door. How am I supposed to get rid of concrete? Okay. Here we go. Big reveal. Is Gregory Gregory? There could be a twist that it's actually Gregory, but I don't know. I don't think it's Gregory anymore, guys. Okay. Gregory! Gregory! You okay? What the hell is that? The mimic? You saved me! You saved me! Gregory? What the fuck is that? Uh, I'm Gregory. What the fuck? <laughs> what the You're fuck? You're not Gregory. What are you? Uh, I'm Gregory. You're the mimic! The mimic. Oh shit! Okay. Get out of here! Run! How can you see? You don't have eyes. Cassie, can you hear me? Gregory? Yeah, I can hear you, Gregory. Is that really you? Yeah. Well... I mean, really, you. How do you have to walk? I've been trying to reach you all night. I'm not at the pizza place. Something's trying to trick you! You're a bit late. This thing in the basement sounds just like you. How do I know this is you for real? Is there another option? You need to get out of there now! How? My friend has access to the building map. Just follow the instructions. Oh, shit. What? How is it that strong? It's a robot. Okay. Okay. I don't my I don't Jesus. It's right behind you. Keep going. Go right. Right. Hurry. Almost there. Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh sh Oh! Oh, you lost your arm! Cassie, it's me. I think I need to explain a few things. You were never supposed to go to the pizza plex. That thing I don't think this is Gregory. I really don't know what it is, but it's been trapped down here a really long time. The Mexus security program was designed to keep it hidden, but you shut down the security, and now it's free. It's not your fault. I know you did it for me, to save me, but we can't risk being followed. I'm sorry. What? No! Oh, that cold son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> She's dead. Well, that was something. I do have to say, Helen Goff, Heather Masters, Cameron Miller, uh, Martha Swebeck Tech, uh, Staffbots, I uh, didn't get the other name. There are a lot of good, good people that worked on this game. It's just... I don't really think that Steel Wool is, uh, I don't really think that they're going to be able to handle FNAF. Because, is this Scott's story? Because it seems like he's retired. Is Scott till, still telling the story? Because I think they need to get Scott, like, on board as, like, a creative director. If he isn't telling the story. Okay, just want to make sure all of the people who worked on this game are credited.
Oh, they did have another uh, game like company working with them. Okay. Like they had multiple people working with on this, not just Steel Wool. But I feel like they do need like maybe Scott to come back to work on like some of the games. I know he's retired from like the the gaming, like the, the, like the coding. But like I I feel Scott should still be able to tell the story of FNAF. Like because. It doesn't feel the same without him. He should come back as like a creative director or something. I know he's directing the movie. Cassie. Wait. Okay. I guess that leads up to the to the next FNAF game after VR. I will probably be playing VR if I do end up getting it. I'll probably buy both and uh, probably play both on YouTube. That's just, that's if I'm physically fit to actually do it. But, um, yeah, there are a few more endings that I think I want to get. So, yeah, I'll probably show those in, like, an ending compilation video. Thank you guys for watching this series. Um, if you guys haven't, uh, make sure to subscribe. Please, I am very desperate. That's why I make content. It's for people to subscribe to me. Please, subscribe.